So we go up to this mountain range here. Mm-hmm. And, and then, then follow west. it west. Oh, through the... And oh. there's the town. That wasn't that far away. Nope. Ooh, look at... Ooh. That always looks like furry fringe to me. And are those clouds above the mountain? Oh. I think it's just an ice cap. Oh, this place is snowy as shit. it's gorgeous. We didn't see Let's this go in Final skiing. Fantasy 1. Yeah. No, this is great. All men from Salmondo were forced to mine mithril at the cave behind the semi waterfall. This is a town of women. All the men are gone. That's really cool. Oh. <laughs> she doesn't want to talk to you. Mithril is mined from the semi cave southwest of here. All their men are gone. This place is super cool. Like, we definitely oh. have not had Whoa. ice down. I'm in love with Joseph, but I only get in his way. I have some more confidence. <laughs> Do you know anything about airships and warships? Do you know anything about Mithril or Wild Rose? You know nothing about nothing. Oh, don't worry. You, girl, you're valid. Girl, you, you. Oh, is this Joseph? Is she just waiting outside his house? Oh, wow, that's creepy. It is. Are you from the Empire? You were hired by Hilda. Youngsters like you? Oh, man. I question her judgment. Mithril still hasn't been recovered from the semi cave. All the townsmen are enslaved there. You must help us. Ooh, and we gotta free those dudes. The warship is huge. Oh, yeah, you knew that. <laughs> I'm afraid I can't tell you anything about airship. Man, Joseph's kind of wild. Also, I, I guess he's the only man that didn't get taken. He's yeah, because Joseph Steele is what? Is he? Um, I, I, I didn't know. catch it. Well, there's been too many hiccups. It'll probably be more evident in the postmortem. Yeah. Oh. Our experience of this game in the last hour or so has been not sequential. No, but it is gorgeous now in the snow-covered world. Yeah, I'm glad that we're here. I'm glad that the recording seems to be performing pretty well. Not across our my head. <laughs> oh, Lord. Oh, yeah, brother. Sorry this magic shot. Um, ooh. Oh, wow, you can get life this early, huh? Anti-warp and exit. Oh, wow, and... Yo, man. Yikes. Well, we'll have to save up to get yeah. that stuff. And that might be a thing that I do to catch us up between recording sessions is buying magics and things. Definitely. This is all assuming we're strong enough to go into the cave and fight the evil empire there. Mm-hmm. Ooh, a longsword. Battle axe. Okay. I think both of those are going to be upgrades. Yeah, that seems right. And then check out the armor shop. We don't have enough money to buy any of this. <laughs> bronze, 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 bronze. So I'm not sure if bronze is better or worse. I don't... That's the one thing. I don't know how to tell for the armors which one is Kiraz yeah. and which one isn't. I'm going to pull it up. Okay. All right, I'm going to save real quick. Maybe saving is what okay. does it. It's just like, don't do that. Bronze is better than leather. But is it... Um, okay. But I do not know... Oh my goodness, sorry, Anne. Those are yetis. Oh, wow. Some... Oh, they've got like green maces and claws, but like pink bodies. Oh, I didn't even see their maces. You're totally right. Oh, that's super cool. They have, they have creepy faces, too. Yeah. like It's just pretty neat. All teeth. Some, uh, what's, the, what's the guy? So, uh, bronze is, is, is heavy armor. We're looking. We want. What we're. What we're. What we're. What we're. What we're. What we're. The armor we're really looking forward to is a copper cuirass. Ooh. Is okay. that how you pronounce that word? I don't know. Cuirass. 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 <laughs> let's queer up this game. Let's <laughs> find a copper cuirass. And so let's do. Let's my long term project. Oh, where are you going? Semi cave. Oh, okay. Hopefully we don't get uh, just destroyed by it. But. Yeah, I kind of feel like we will. But, uh... Hmm... Do you know where the cave is? Uh, they said southwest. I okay. just assumed, you know. I'd just check it out. Let's try anti on these on these fools. What does it even do? I don't know. I just guessed it on all of them, though. Oh, it reduces their MP. Okay. Cool. Totally but what, you know what that is, though, is it gives white mages something to do in battle. Um, yeah, that's that true. Uses MP. Absolutely. Without using up heals and stuff. It's so kind like, of a pain you can... to watch these animations go by, though. That is true. Yeah. Group casting, as usual, everything yeah. to watch. Not, not necessarily a huge uh, 
necessity in that particular instance to do a group cast. I, don't, I think I'm just so excited by the ability to group cast that I just kind of it is fun done it for all the spells. Yeah. I didn't do it. With, oh, I did. All right. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Everybody group cast all the time. Also, oh, I know people were mourning the loss of Busy Box Pizza, but A, it's never dead in our hearts. No, it lives, um, lives forever within us. And there's no reason that uh, when we can create a custom party again in uh, <laughs> Final Fantasy 3 that they just, they shan't return. Are the characters in 3 less prescribed? Okay. Then mm-hmm. yeah, that'll It's kind of like 1. Okay. If I recall correctly. Then there's definitely, you know, room for us to bring back Busy Box, or if people have some other idea yeah. or if we have another idea maybe they get new employees who knows yeah ooh I don't really have any idea where I'm going you're going the right way semi falls oh you can't go up waterfalls okay Mm. I do know I do know the the long way that you kind of have to take at this point I think I'm going the right way I think you are I think you just you know what you do you boo I will do me I'm almost out of mana, though, and that's probably bad. Why did I do a group cast again? Wait, I don't have to commit to that. No! And I got the benefit of my select cancel. Not intentional. Just happens sometimes. <laughs> it's nice to know. It is nice to know that, you know, at least you're not completely wasting your time. <laughs> that's true. That's true. I'm not. I'm doing it right. Oof. That's a lot of damage. To the leg eater. Leg eater. Leg otter. Leg otter? Guys, leg otter! <laughs> they leg got her. <laughs> leg otter? I hardly know her. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. Are you familiar with the dad joke? I'll try not to talk entirely in memes. <laughs> Are you familiar with the dad joke? I, I've, I know. From internet? Listen, I know what a dad joke is. I'm not sure what you mean when you say the dad joke. Oh, like you, you make you it say, sound like there is an ultimate dad well, joke. Well, like it's it's like when you say, "Dad, I'm tired," and he says, "Hi, tired, I'm dad." Yeah, that's yeah. a dad joke. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um, <laughs> <laughs> there was a Tumblr post. This is the level the commentary has descended to. <laughs> but it's the song uh, that Tears for Fears song. But it says, uh, "The dreams in which I'm dying." <laughs> Oh yeah, well, the best dying, I am a dad. <laughs> <laughs> I thought of that just now. I had a great time recalling that moment. Now That's you fun. can all enjoy it too. Now I can't select spells because of MP. She has no MPs. Oh no! We'll fight now. Yeah, I guess she can work on her unarmed skill. Yeah, I guess. I can't also... It won't let me... No, I have to fight the front goblin first. Yep. Uh, the... One in the back is more than two rows from the person in front. So yeah, I did. I did read that part of the mechanics as well. So second album of the week, Ryan. Oh, we have two albums yeah. of the week. Yep, folks. Uh, Agent Orange, Living in Darkness. Also, is, so which good. one is the band? Uh, Agent Orange. Okay. Yeah. Great. It's good. Also very short. I know so much about music. Guys, let me <laughs> tell you that. I was listening to a lot of the stuff. Been really into it. It's been cheering me up. This is all at work. Oh yeah, in the car when I'm going places. Hmm. You know, that's a Whoa. lot of hornets in a that's a, oh, a queen, queen bee. bee. <laughs> oh man, that's awesome. It's Beyonce. <laughs> it's Beyonce. I don't know what to do with you now. This is. I mean, not... you could move her to the front and have her just fight. But then it'll ruin her soul. Her soul will be forfeit. Well, A, we don't care about her soul. We care about her int. And oh, fighting doesn't hurt your int? I mean your soul? It hurts both. Um, but not as not as bad as it uh, as casting spells increases it. So I don't know that we really need to worry about it. Oh, really, right. she could do something. I haven't really thought about this potential uh, loss of... Spe- I guess that's why it lets you... You can buy, like, ethers, right? In this game? Yeah, yeah, I'm pretty sure we saw that and in the store. And you buy ethers, right? <laughs> I don't know. Back in you buy ethers and phosphates. <laughs> yeah, I'd, I'd go for a cherry phosphate right about now. <laughs> hey, back in my Final Fantasy one, we could only rest it and run it in. 
could only save the game. Didn't have any houses back then. Mm -hmm. Had a cabin, of course. But it is interesting to watch the progression of saving. Like yeah. in Dragon Warrior, you could only save at the king. Nowhere else in the <laughs> yeah, entire game. That's actually really true. Final Fantasy One, you could save at any inn, and also if you used a piece of portable housing somehow. Don't worry about how that. And works. then they just collapse afterwards. Yeah. <laughs> Um, oh. In oh, okay. Envenomed. And then now you can save anywhere on the overworld map for free. Oh, that's such a nice thing. Which makes me wonder what the portable housing does in this game. Because there was a cottage item. Let's use her health. Okay. It might also give you MP. Who knows? But it was Ooh. like absurdly expensive. Ooh, I see. It's permanent. Oh, I don't like that. Oh. Uh, Hold on. Whoa, whoa, yeah, uh, Min. Min's probably got something in his bag of tricks. Let's see what you got. Heal. That's what heal does. Oh, I gotta know what peep does, though. <laughs> That's yeah. crazy. I think it probably lets you view hit points. Oh, you think? I think you can do that. You should try that in battle at some point and just see what's up. Yeah, I will try it. I will try it. I also like how they gave Min a bunch of partial credit in like all of his spells yeah he's in like he's, he's clearly involved. been using them actively lately oh hey uh, hey i think this is what we're looking for it's great let's to go save. in here with no mp <laughs> Ooh, it's oh my goodness hold on right, we gotta save we'll, we'll appreciate that in a moment okay uh i'll and save he's more. but one that's fine i'm rotating through the remainder now okay this is the, pretty much the dopest thing look at that look at, look at that view out into the I outside know. world that that's is super cool un Precedented in the series so far. That is, it just gave this whole dungeon a new dimension. Also, what is it? A gorgeous yellow? Yeah, it is a very mm. bright yellow. Very, uh. Like the whole place is made of Ooh. gold. What is this? It's a cool rock. Nice purple rock. Oh, Ooh, I love the yellow Yeti cave. Yeah. I think our boy Guy might need a little help. Yes, he might. Let's get you some magic. Cure you. Cure what? Cure two. That dungeon music is familiar to me. I think it might have been in Theater Rhythm or something. Oh. Or some other game, but I definitely I know I it. I didn't know that you had played that game. Theater Rhythm? Yeah. I have both of them. Whoa, I didn't know that. In fact, I'm pretty sure I have Curtain Call just like sitting over here on the oh, table next to me. Dang. Room. Along with Yoshi's Island DS game. Oh, there you are. Blamo. Now we can... Well, on let's the just couch. Switch, let's switch gears real quick. <laughs> let's just and pull out the 3DS capture card we have. <laughs> yeah. Did I tell you that I saw that a 3DS capture unit is actually just a modded 3DS? No. Like, you order it for, like, $450 from China oh, or something. Oh, gosh. And, and it's just a, a 3DS in a box, but it has a USB port what? that you plug into your computer and it records. That is wild. But, yeah, it's like a special 3DS. Like, it is not just a thing you... Plug into your 3DS. Is that or how like, most people do it? If they do it at all? I think so at this point. Like, I'm sure, wow. like, you could probably get some, like, kit where you have to solder it into your 3DS or something like that. But it seems simpler to just, like, spend the money and just get... Can you push it or anything? It doesn't seem to allow me to. What in the world is that? Just a chair. Maybe that's the big block of Mithril. And that we just need Maybe some, it the... is Mithril. Oh, it's these guys! Well, I, don't I don't know, know that we, we've seen these we, guys yeah, we didn't in, encounter in this recording. In the actual LP yet. We did last time, but we lost it. These guys are horrible. They are horrifying. They're they are, so gross. They're one big foot. Oh my gosh, they're f right, what color are they? Uh, they're like a ice blue. Oh, if they were purple, they would be flying purple people eaters. Uh, one, one dang it. Big, one lo long beak and one big eye. <laughs> flying Actually, purple the eye's people. not really that big. One big did eye. Did I tell you that I noticed in Dark Souls, huh. um, you know the like little... Basilisk frog guys that turn you yes. out, that curse you and turn to, you to stone. They're true of life. Yeah. Um, you know how they have those like big eye looking things on their heads? Those mm -hmm. are not their eyes. What? Yes. What are they? If you orient the camera right around to their face, they have real eyes right above their little mouth, and they're like Ooh. tiny little beady eyes. That's gross. Those eyes on top must be like fake like frog eyes. You know how some frogs have that too? Yeah. That's terrifying, actually. Like also in real very life. Detailed. Yeah. It's like a really fine detail. Like it, it is hard to see. Anyway, <sighs> never, never not Dark Souls. I said, Mister Purple People Eater, don't eat me. Don't eat meat. Don't don't eat me. Oh okay. Yeah, don't eat us, man. This is a fight. 
He lit on the ground and started rocking around. Why can't I remember the lyrics to Purple People here? Oh, I don't know them at all. Oh, really? Oh, he he says, I want to get a job in a rock and roll band. Bless my soul, pigeon toll, flying purple people leader. <laughs> and, then, and then he says, I like short shorts, flying purple people leader. Sure looks strange to me. And then I saw him last night on the TV show. He was <laughs> blowing it out, really knocking him dead, playing rock and roll music through the horn in his head. Wow, oh, you just, you got it. Yep, I got it. Found it. I love that song. <laughs> I have a huge love of 50s novelty songs. <laughs> I love Monster Mash. But really, who doesn't love Monster Mash, uh, to be sure? That's the truest. HBO? Oh, yeah. wait, I... Oh. Only for Guy, though? Come on. Yeah, did Furion, do you have to end the battle? Like, with weapons? Like, is it an end status thing to get health? Because it's not that he lost it, but that he, st he started. I, I don't... I think we were wrong about that. I think it is just if you lose enough. Because he lost more than half. I, uh, I feel like he did, mm -hmm. but... Uh, Maybe it wasn't good enough for the game. Yeah. Might not have been. All right. Anyway, onward. Onward. This is ah, this is gorgeous. Ooh, the so, chest is a special like gold color to match the. Ooh, ten hole gill. Wow, it's a, a thrill. Only minute. a single sprinter this time. Well, he's gonna get I'm wrecked. Not really sure. Ah, uh, he ambushed us. Oh, and he missed. Did I tell you, uh, or did you see that the ambush and preemptive strike rate is based on Furion's evasion? Yes. Which is why it's probably not the worst that he's in the front row for now. Yeah, we need him to take hits. We're gonna target it. Yeah, get targeted. Ooh, he did it with the axe, though. Nice crit. Crit, that's Sprinter. Also, the, the a rock and roll critical hit uh, mechanics are still unknown. <laughs> what? Yeah, to this day. Buried somewhere in the code. The current belief is that there's a flat 1% chance that isn't affected by anything, but... Wow. Yeah. Or somewhere in that neighborhood, anyway. I really should do something with uh, Maria. I almost called her Lisa. If you moved her to the front row, she'd at least be getting attacked some and Truth. be getting her I think defensive I'll move her stats up. This just to make it useful. Yeah, well, we we should really um, at some point grind up her MP a little bit, just by having them whack each other while she just casts spells on everything. Yeah, totally. Yeah, this is one of the major limitations of the spells costing more if you don't have the items to deal with it. Ooh. Well, even if they didn't, though, she'd be out of MP. True. If if they if the spells only cast one, like that's still only sixteen casts as it stands. Did I go that way? Uh, you have not gone up yet. But I see a chest. Yeah. So down we go. Fair enough. Oh! Balloons. Oh, those are bombs. I think for the yeah. Very those are first totally time. bombs. Wow. Whoa! They, they are look, fiendish they, looking. They, they look day glow. They are terrifying. Oh, yeah, they're they're super neon, like oh, neon man. green with pink eyes and pink teeth. Oh, they're probably my favorite enemy so far. They I mean, they're really pretty cool. cool. <laughs> yeah, I do like Teen Ogre though. Teen Ogre. <laughs> Teen Ogre. Teen Ogre is kind of great. <laughs> it's just, it looks so glum. Looks like he's going to detention. Whoa! Did you see that? Oh, he blasted. Oh man, they're it was, definitely it bombs. It was wild they are, though. They're classic bombs. Yeah, it shook the whole screen and it like turned yellow. It's great. Oof, 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 oof. What a wacky world that we in this cave of yellow. Wacky cave world. Oh, punch, punch, punch. Basically, Tifa Lockhart right now. <laughs> yeah. Corey, you're getting a little ahead of us here. What? <laughs> I went this way. Why did I go this way? I well, now we know where the staircase is. Yay. That's fine. Great. Oh, no! Oh, shit. Well, this he's not a captain. We might be able to true. take a soldier. This soldier guy looks so cool. They, it, like yeah, I this before, It has that stubby little um, British fiend folio style. The D&D &D Oh, books. right, right, yeah. yeah. Like, they're all cramped. I love it. Yeah. That. <laughs> I love his puffy legs. Yeah, it's great. <laughs> his shield, like the sword, is kind of like a, a little curved. Yeah, and it's like Oof. a little little stubber. He hits hard though. Does he? Oh yeah, he does. Kinda. Um, let's see what you got, Min. Can you do blink like on the whole party? Ooh, let's do it. I don't remember what it said about 
casting party wide. Um, yeah, I think it like the higher the level of those magics mm -hmm. and the higher chance that they succeed and if you cast it party wide i think it reduces the chance, chance to fail okay yeah. um Oof. i'm not totally sure i don't really remember that part of what i was doing mm. no no don't change change <laughs> is bad let's try peep wait <laughs> i peep myself <laughs> I peep myself. I peep myself. No, Mom! I'll never know. I peep myself. <laughs> oh. oh, no. Oh, no, that's good. HBF. Level up. Oh, Level oh, up. Oh, yeah. Wow. Guy's just a machine. It's because we got so many hits in. And we got treasure. Yay. Got that antidote. I want it. Nice. Oh. Now it's time to exit the treasure screen. Yay. Okay, so we haven't fully optimized the treasure screen, but that's okay. That's fine. Um, oh. Ooh, well, that's a better treasure. Yeah, I actually want money in this game. Like, it's kind of hard to get money, I feel like. Maybe I'm just saying that. Uh, it's actually pretty... It's a pretty quick grind to get it. Oh, okay. If you're just, if you're you're just like, staying near a town to, it. you know, recharge your MP, it's not that bad. Like, I ground up 1,600 gil... No, more than that. About two grand to get all the spells and all of the equipment. And that oh. was just on monsters that were right near Altea. Okay. So goblins and hornets. That's about it. Brian, I said, uh, Mr. Purple People Eater, what's your line? He said, eating purple people, and it sure is fine. <laughs> you see, it's a common misconception that the Purple People Eater is purple mm -hmm. and eats people. But he actually only eats purple, purple people. people. Which is why he's actually like relatively harmless because purple yeah, people not so common. When he gets to Earth, he just wants to rock. Yeah, and he has a saxophone built into his head. Oh, there's no, nothing up there's here. Nothing. I like that the cave plunges into darkness. Though. Yeah, those are kind of scary. Like just like mm -hmm, mm -hmm. you know abysses in the floor. I love it. Strip mining this place. This yellow abyss for that mithril. Yeah, is one of the radioactive elements yellow? Oh, I don't know. Like uranium. Or plutonium. Aren't they all glowy green? Isn't that the idea? I don't know. I believe that's what Simpsons has taught us. True. Is that all radioactive material glows green and is in the form of little, like, little pipes. glowy bars? Yeah. Bars, yeah. I don't know. Rods. Uh, rods. Rods. Rods, yeah. yeah. Is that's... that. Okay. So, wh whoever is a nuclear person <laughs> or a mutant. Whoever among you is nuclear. Please, could you please you tell come us. from a nuclear family. What color? Perhaps you can tell us. Is anything yellow? What color? The radioactive material that you all huddled around for growth <laughs> is. We'd appreciate it. I really want to know what color radioactive materials are and what shape they come in. I feel Maybe like they're probably just like, just like black or gray. Really? They're, they're metals, right? Do they glow? Is that just a convention? I don't know of anything about this shit. Like, I'm just any. No, we do, we continue this conversation. We're just going to embarrass ourselves. Oh, like, I already have. I don't know. They're soft about. like putty, right? Yeah, totally. <laughs> they're fragrant, right? They named plutonium after the dog. <laughs> because it's actually wet, like dog slobber. Yeah. Oh, we're just going down right now. Oh. Whoa! This is oh, this is awesome. This is so cool. Oh, and it's full of yetis. It's like a it's like a drilling water pit. Oh, we got ambushed by the yetis. It uh -oh. is, yeah, it totally is. Like how they uh, have to keep the drills wet to keep them from overheating and breaking. Ooh, or it's been abandoned so long that it's just started to fill with water. Ooh, that makes way more sense than my industrial you're... explanation. <laughs> I mean, I don't know. They're building airships and warships and stuff. That's true. They probably have quite the need for raw material. Maybe everyone in this world is radioactive and they just live in this... Uh, you're not afraid of this uranium cave? Uh, that would explain why everyone's hair is such wild colors, though. Yeah. Got the blues Alternate and the pinks. And AU, where the uh, Empire is actually just humans. And these are, we're actually all hideous monsters. <laughs> oh, man. Who, who can't speak the same language. We were the monster all along. Oh, classic sci-fi trope. <laughs> monsters? They look like monsters to you? That's some Silent Hill 3 for you right there. Oh, oh yeah. Some, some Vincent playing with Heather's brain. Oh. Uh -huh. Messing with her mind. Oof. There's that, uh, 
Do you know the Lovecraft story of the Outsider? I don't... Ask me anything about any Lovecraft story and I will oh. we'll know. So, I haven't read any Lovecraft. It is embarrassing because I really like Lovecraft stuff. But oh, that's I right. actually meant to ask you um, after movie yeah. night if you would, if you had anything that I could borrow to read. Yes, totally. Yeah. It's packed up right now, but it will be right, so of course, in a place. Yeah. But then I definitely do. How's the packing going? Uh, <laughs> great? Great. Okay, good. Just the greatest. Corey's moving. We're moving. Uh, to a different apartment in the same complex, so don't worry. But it has one more room. It does have an additional All the rooms room. All shrink slightly, but there are more of them. Yeah. I think the, the, there's a net gain on square footage. Net gain. Yeah. For an, you know. I'm excited to see this place. I haven't, I haven't seen yeah, it Yeah, I'm excited too. It will be nice. The goal is to get Chrissy some office space and light up the joint and not like that. I think Tracy might have forgotten that you guys were moving tomorrow and that you'd want help. Uh, we decided to do push it to Sunday because we oh. need room time to pack. So, okay. I drop, I drop, you drop, he drop, she drop, they drop. Because I know she was talking about uh, hanging out with Travis tomorrow after I get off work. Oh, okay. I don't know if we are, you know. I mean, I figured you guys must be busy packing and doing all that. Perhaps, yeah. Yeah. It is tough to pack stuff. Tough to pack. I cannot... These bombs are held. If we moved out of here, it would take us weeks to pack it all up at this well, point. Well, we have a week to do it, too. Because it's a move out. Mm -hmm. We've like, been in this apartment a lot longer than you guys have been true. in yours, though. You, like, we, are, we have just shit everywhere. You, you kipple-wise, yeah. <laughs> yeah. We'd have to throw away a lot of things, Everybody be missing so much. Yeah. They just gotta get their weapon skill I up. I love these Dayglow monsters. I know. Well, see, the the bombs, yeah, are also neon type monster. Yeah, that's true. It's yeah. really lending credence to the theory My, that everything is just a radioactive nightmare pit that we're yeah. from. Maybe we crawled out of the nightmare pit, and that's why the the knights hunted us down. Oh yeah, we are the abomination that is. Oh, oh yeah, that animation is so good. Wild. Ooh, Maria's gonna get some health. Don't kill us, goblin. Two hits. Yeah. I like the machine gun noise. Ooh. Oh, wow. He targeted tried. her. He Let's tried. Go. Get that invasion out. Yeah. Axes for Fear. Fear seems to be getting stronger. Ooh, he got three hits there? Yeah, he did. That's good. HP up. Let's see what we got. 53. A modest gain. You want to take a break and get another beer? Yeah, let's do that while I heal up our folks. Yeah. 